our Heavenly Father, Creator of all things. Father, you are holy, righteous, glorious, and almighty. We give you all the honor, glory, and praise. In the name of Jesus, I pray. Amen. Hello everyone. Happy, happy new year to you. Happy new year. Happy new year. Happy January. Hi everyone. Hi everyone. Sister G here. Glenda Coker known as Spiritual Name Gloria. I am here, a messenger, a messenger of God, our Father, our Heavenly Father. I am here just connecting with you every single week, online, offline, every single day of my life. I am your sister. Happy New Year, everyone. Uh, Welcome, welcome to the show. Those of you who are new, I welcome you. And I encourage everyone, everyone to go and share the show. Go and share the show. This show is just all about reading Bible scriptures and discussing them with you. I want you to go over to uh, www.praiseandprayer.org. I want you to check out that site. And that site, if you would like to submit a prayer request, if you would like to dedicate or rededicate your life uh, to the Lord, acknowledging that Jesus Christ is Lord, that he died, that he rose uh, for our lives to take away sickness, sins, iniquities, everything. If you want to... Um, receive that and dedicate or rededicate yourself. That site, www.praiseandprayer.org, is the site to do it. There is a salvation prayer there. There is a prayer there at the top. Go ahead and press play and receive your blessings. Receive your blessings. Just pray along with that prayer. Um, the site is truly, truly blessed and inspired. Um, inspired by God. So um, also for visiting that site and um, dedicating or rededicating your life to um, Christ Jesus right there. There's a free PDF book right there uh, for you to enjoy, download, and um, have on your device, your phone, or wherever you download it from. Um, you can contact me at worship, worship at praiseandprayer.org. That is my email address, worship at praiseandprayer.org. Be sure to come back every single day um, to that site. There is a um, a, pra- a, um, a scripture that comes out seven days a week there. So be sure... That you come back every single day. There's a new scripture there. Uh, just scroll down a little bit to the bottom. Also there's some nice melody um, music there. Um, that um, nice sounding melody music that you can listen to. As you scroll down that site. It's just a one page um, site. Just a one page self explanatory site right there. I also want you to check out www.glendacoker.com. Dot com G L E N D A C O K E R. Um, at the top left there, there are icons there. Um, social media media icons. Um, you can follow me on any of those um, social media sites, and I will be sure to follow you back. Um, also down at the bottom. Um, there is information there, my contact information, telephone number if you want to call, um, leave a message, or whatever you may want to do um, there. Also, be sure to get on that email list, email list uh, from time to time. Um, just to give you a thanks um, every now and then, you know, um, I'll give you a little gift or something. Um, just to, to, I just really appreciate you all um, here on the show and um, visiting the sites there. Um, I thank you all. And again, feel free to share out the shows. And um, I just love you guys. I just love you. I'm here as your sister. 
Um, we're to love the Lord with everything that we have, our whole mind, body, soul, everything. And then he commands us also to love our neighbors, our neighbor as ourselves. And that's not only the people that we live close to, it's people in the surrounding communities also as well. It's people that we come in contact with every single day. Um, even if it's just for a moment, even if we're at the store and we're in the presence of someone or whatever, just have that love. Just spread that love out. Um, everyone, we are brothers and sisters here um, on the same field, um, just sharing that love and, and spreading the gospel of the Lord. Um, that is what we are here to do, doing the work of the Lord. And as you know, um, well, it's all about um, Jesus. We've been talking about um, Jesus is the season. Jesus, every single day, celebrate Jesus every single day. Um, celebrate his, his his birth, his life, his death, uh, resurrection. Celebrate Jesus every single day. Thank God for all the thing, all all the things that He does, and all the just being an awesome, awesome Father. And for sending Jesus, we are here to give thanks and, and love every single day of our lives. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. We serve an awesome, awesome God. God is good all the time. Hallelujah. <laughs> Praise the Lord. Praise the Lord. And I mean, this this holiday season, um, it's just been so much love floating around and just so much um, joy. And um, we need to just express that all through the year. All through the year. Um, I just I just feel so, so loved. And, and giving that love back um, through the Holy Spirit. It's just a beautiful, wonderful um, thing. Just a beautiful time um, in my life and in all of our lives. So I just thank you all for being here. Um... And um, if you ever want to start your own show, um, everybody has a voice. If you feel like this is for you, um, go ahead and start your show. Um, get on any um, Lisbon, Blog Talk Radio, Spreaker. There are a lot of platforms there um, that will host your site. And um, you can embed that um, um, player on your site. You know, people can come. Uh, wherever you're um, doing your show. So if you feel free, feel free to do that. And if you ever have any questions or anything, feel free to ask uh, me. And um, I'll try my best to answer those. Or if I, I unable to, you know, I'll try my best to find that answer for you. But everything is um, on those sites, Blog Talk Radio, Lisbon, or wherever um, that you see that fits um, your needs. I mean, you want to start a show. Everything basically is self-explanatory on those sites, and they walk you through it. And um, they have um, customer service and things like that if you ever, you know, need any help. So feel free if this is you, if this is um, your platform, um, feel free, feel free. Um, we, we're here to, again, just spread the word um Online, offline, everywhere that we go. Because, I mean, it's just awesome. And and we don't know when Jesus is coming. Jesus will be coming back. So we want to be ready. Get ready. Be ready. Stay ready. And um, we have been reading um, about Jesus um, around the holiday. But before that, we read about Joseph. And um, we're just reading stories in the Bible now. And then I'm going to, um, this is that season right now for the show. And then um, a little while later, I don't know, a couple weeks or so or whatever, we'll be talking about the Holy Spirit. We'll do some shows on the Holy Spirit. Um, and we'll do some other shows as well. Um, so just stay tuned. Just stay tuned. And again, I all my contact information, glendacoca.com, if any questions, comments, or anything that you have. And again, on praiseandprayer.org, submit your prayer requests and also any questions or anything that you may have. Uh, put them all in that box right there on that site. So this week, we are going to be reading about Solomon. We're going to be reading, get your Bibles. I'm reading from the King James Version um, get your Bibles, 
And um, I'm going to be reading 1 Kings chapter 3. I'm going to start at verse 3. Um, this is all about Solomon, 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 Solomon. So we're reading about the story of Solomon this week. Um, and the synopsis here, um, 1 Kings chapter 3 says, Solomon loves the Lord and keeps his commandments. And then the Lord appears to Solomon and promises him a wise and an understanding heart. He judges between two harlots, Solomon does, and determines maternity of a child. So let's start by reading. Get your Bibles ready. 1 Kings chapter 3, verse 3. And if you don't have the King James Version up, um, that's okay. Any version that you read from is okay. Um, follow along if you don't have your Bibles up. Um, so I'll begin reading um, verse 3 to verse 28. 1 Kings chapter 3. Verse 3 through 28. And Solomon loved the Lord, walking in the statues of David his father. Only he sacrificed and burned incense in high places. And the king went to Gibeon to sacrifice there, for that was the great high place. A thousand burnt offerings did Solomon offer upon that altar. In Gibeon, the Lord appeared to Solomon in a dream by night. And God asked, and God said, Ask what I shall give thee. And Solomon said, Thou hast showed unto thy servant David my father great mercy. According to as he walked before thee in truth and in righteousness and in uprightness of heart with thee. And thou hast kept for him this great kindness that thou hast given him a son to sit on his throne as it is this day. And now, O Lord, my God, Thou hast made thy servant king instead of David, my father. And I am but a little child. I know not how to go out or come in. And thy servant is in the midst of thy people, which thou hast chosen a great people. That cannot be numbered nor counted for multitude. Give therefore thy servant an understanding heart to judge thy people that I may discern between God, between good and bad. For who is able to judge this? Thy so great a people. And the speech pleased the Lord. That Solomon had asked this thing. And God said unto him. Because thou hast asked this thing. And hast not asked for thyself long life. Neither hast asked riches for thyself. Nor hast asked the life of thine enemies. But has asked for thyself understanding to discern judgment. Behold, I have done according to thy words. Lo, I have given thee a wise and an understanding heart, so that there was none like thee before thee, neither after thee shall any arise like unto thee. And I have also given thee that which thou hast not asked, both riches and honor, so that there shall not be any among the kings like unto thee all thy days. And if thou wilt walk in my ways to keep my statutes and my commandments, as thy father David did walk, 
Then I will lengthen thy days.